Hi, it's Jennifer with Jennifer at Home. I'm so happy you joined me today to make some easy quesadillas. Okay, so we have a griddle that's getting nice and hot with some melted butter. We're gonna put that flour tortilla shell down. Then we're gonna add some cheese. We're only gonna put cheese on half of this. So we're just going to do one half. And spread that out nice and thin. And then we're going to add some beans and some taco meat. And these beans are pinto beans. These are pinto beans with jalapenos and they're medium heat. But you can put anything in here you want. I just mixed them in with some ground taco meat. You can use shredded chicken, you can use pork, you can use anything you want. You can even just make a cheese quesadilla. So then I'm going to put this topping right on the cheese, only on the side with the cheese. Spread it nice and thin. It's okay if a little bit falls out. I'll scoop it right back up. Okay, now I'm going to put cheese on top of this. Cheese is the glue. The cheese will hold all of this together. And this is just a cheddar and taco cheese. It's a mixture of a few different cheeses. It's, I think it's called a Mexican blend. So it's perfect for a quesadilla. Okay, I can hear that shell sizzling. I'm gonna turn the heat down a little bit. Next thing I need to do is just take that tortilla shell and flip it right in half and press it down just just like a taco. So it looks just like a taco. You can see it's nice and buttery. So press that down so the cheese melts and holds everything together. All right. And once you do that and it starts to get run, you can hear it sizzling. Just flip it right over to the other side. There we go, and that's how it looks. It looks just like a quesadilla. It has that nice, crunchy, golden shell. And then we'll let that sizzle for a minute right there on the griddle, or you could use a skillet. And then we'll just take this and put it on a cutting board and cut it into three big triangles and into three wedges. And this is how the quesadilla turned out. I just serve it with some sour cream and I just made some homemade pico de gallo. One of our very favorite ways to make quesadillas is to put scrambled eggs, bacon crumbs, and cheese and make these for breakfast. And they turn out wonderful. We absolutely love making breakfast quesadillas in the morning with scrambled eggs, cheese, bacon, or you could use sausage. And if you use a low carb tortilla shell, then you have a low carb quesadilla as well. I'm so glad you were here to make these quesadillas. I hope you can see how easy they were. They only just took minutes to put together and they're great for an easy lunch or for an appetizer to share with friends. If you enjoyed this video, I would love for you to like, share it and subscribe and ring the bell so you can get a notification every time I have a new video out.